But the main reason is a lot of agents who check the pot prefer an orange peel uh, finish when it comes to the reveal. It's just basically so it matches matches the um, the wall area as well. So I've just let that go soak in a bit. Don't need to like put too much pressure, I'll just do it lightly. And that's basically it, and then just rub it in the excess emulsion off. Right, so there you go, that's how you paint a window reveal. Cut it in with a brush and roll it, roll it the flat of the reveal with a roller. Might have to go over it a couple of times, reload the roller up and go over it a second time, but that's basically, you can do it just to finish it off with a brush, but trust me, when, when, it, when it dries, you can see all the brush marks and it, you get a better finish with a roller, so, and that's what they're expecting. And the same applies if you're doing like Mrs. Jones, you know, for 60 quid a day. Or whether you're doing it for yourself. Um, <coughs> if you're doing it for yourself or a private job, obviously you're going to have to cut in to the window because there'll be no protection on, on the plastic. And um, needless to say, you're going to need to re-undercoat and gloss uh, most, most window boards if you're redecorating it. Not. So yeah, that's basically how it's done uh, and I'll continue that procedure through the whole of this four bed that I'm doing probably take me an hour to do all the window reveals in there uh, and then I'll come back and undercoat gloss as well so I hope you enjoyed the content of this video if you did don't forget to give us a thumbs up subscribe and share to all your mates from the Candleman Catch you later. So I'm here on site, been sent to paint this fucking house, and we ain't got no windows in. What the fuck's going off here? Mm.